The key to preventing and fighting a future pandemic may take place in Charlotte. Queen City News anchor Ryan Kruger tells us about a new research center launching at UNC Charlotte, specifically focused on pandemics. UNC Charlotte was one of the first colleges in the country to look at the wastewater to find out where COVID-19 was spreading. Now, the university has bigger plans. We want to really get ahead of that, though, and understand the process of uh, animal to human transmission. Dr. Dan Janis heads up the brand new Center for Computational Intelligence to Predict Health and Environmental Risks, or CIFER for short. UNC Charlotte recently received the largest amount of state funding for research in the school's history. We're going to study also how viruses evolve once they're in the human population. Um, did they evade our immune system? Can we better design uh, drugs against them using artificial intelligence? Speaking of artificial intelligence, Janice tells me their computers were able to realize just how contagious Omicron would be long before any lab test. He's hoping that kind of work will help governments stay prepared for the next pandemic. We had a lot of warning about what could happen with SARS-CoV-2, but it, it didn't emerge to the level of seriousness for governments around the world to uh, to respond appropriately. UNC Charlotte on the forefront. The university also hiring new scientists to focus on preventing and preparing for the next pandemic.